Hello everybody, I am Tadashimori and today I'll teach you how to make this origami butterfly by Huan Chen Quiet. I don't know if you remember him, but I already made two videos of his works, his origami pig and his origami swan. Well, he's a really talented origami artist from Vietnam, so well, you should really visit his Flickr to see more of his works. Uh, the link is in the video description. So, let's start! Okay, so to make this origami here, you're going to use one square sheet of paper with color only on one side and white on the other side. We're going to start with the white side face it up and fold first both diagonals and you're going to fold in half in the horizontal and vertical. So, like this, and here. just like this. Now you're going to fold here making the side of the paper go up to the diagonal like this but you're not going to fold everything you're going to fold only only up to the middle line here okay and unfold. Now do the same thing here to this side and unfold. Now do the same thing here to all four sides. So I am just going to fast forward this part. Okay, now you're going to fold here along this line here. And you're going to use this line as reference. You had this line here, right? This one and this one. You're just going to fold exactly here in this point. So just fold here like this and fold only up to the diagonal, to both diagonals. Like this. Okay? Do the same thing to all four sides. Okay, so in this point we have something like this. Now you're going to make a fold along this line here. Making... Okay, just make a fold here from this point to this point here. Okay. and do the same thing here now you're going to fold here making this line here go up to this line here so it's going to be like this okay. Okay, so we just made this line here, only up to the diagonal, okay, now you have to do the same thing here, and, and again, do the same thing to the other side. Okay, so do the same thing here.
Okay, so in this point we got something like this. Now fold here this point up to this point here. So like this. And you're just going to fold from this point here downward like this. Okay? Do the same thing to this side here. So it's going to look like this. Okay, so no more pre-crease. We are going to fold now. So turn the model over and make a fold here along this line here. But fold only up to this point here. Okay? Now you're going to make this valley fold. Okay? And you're going to fold here along. Let me just show you. Fold here along this line at the same time. So it's going to be like this. Okay? And squash here in the model. So do the same thing here, the other side. It's going to be like this. Right? Now you're going to pull here this layer, okay. making this line we just made align with this one here, the side of this inner layer. So it's going to look like this. Okay, do the same thing here. Okay, like this. Now we have to make it's not aligned here. You're going to make now a valley fold along this line here. Okay, and a mountain fold along this line here at the same time so it's going to be like this fold here in half okay this this layer here in half and you're going to make this valley fold and mountain fold okay like this now fold here this flap upward like this now you're going to do the same thing here it's going to be a little bit hard to get the reference now but it's the same thing first you're going to fold along the first line okay. make here a fold like this here also, I'm going to fold like this. Okay, now pull here this layer and this layer. Fold the whole flap here in the middle. and make the valley fold and mountain fold at the same time. So basically as you could see here it's the same thing but it's a little bit hard to get the reference because the shape of the model it's a little bit different but well it's basically the same thing. Okay now turn the model over and now you're going to fold here the whole model in half but at the same time you fold here, you're going to make a valley fold along this line and this line, making these three points get close to each other. So it's going to be like this, folding half and join here, making these three points get aligned like this. Okay. Okay, now you're going to make a valley fold here along this line, okay, only on the top layer, 
like this. Okay, turn the model over and do the same thing here. The model will not lie flat for now. So you're going to do this now. Looking to the top part of the origami, it's going to look like this. Open here a little bit, okay, and you're going to make a valley fold along this line and this line here, making at the same time you're going to make this uh, a mountain fold along this and this line, making this line go up to this line and this one go up to this one here. So let me let me show you. I think it's better. So it's like this: make a valley fold, and it's going to look like this. Okay. Now fold here everything. So now you're going to open here everything like this. Okay, you had something like this. Now open everything Oops. okay and here you're going to do this you're going to open this part a little bit make a valley fold along this line here okay, so a valley fold like this and this part here is going to be a little bit confusing so it's like this Align here these two layers. You're going to align and fold here down. Squash the paper like this. Okay, and the same thing here. So align these two layers and fold down like this. Okay, so the model will going to look like this. Now the last part, fold here. Okay. Turn the model over. Fold here along this line, making these two lines, this flap here be folded in half like this, and fold all the way down here. Okay. Now unfold this flap, you're going to make now a closed sink, it's going to be like this, open here a little bit and push here the middle, reversing along the line we just made. So this kind of fold, fold is a little bit hard to make if your first time, but after you get used to it, it's going to be easy. So do the same thing here. And well, with this, we just folded all the crease pattern. Okay, as you can see here, the model is still not a butterfly and well, we are going to make some details here. And this is going to be the nice part of this origami because as you can see, the model do not lie flat. It's going to be more artistic and it has lots of curves. Okay, so let me show you how to make these curves. First of all, Turn the model over. You're going to fold here this point up to this point here. Okay? Like this. And press here. And as you can see, the model do not lie flat. You're going to do the same thing here to this side. And the model will look like this. 
Now you're going to press here a little bit, okay, and make a curve here, right? And okay, this part here you're going to pull. You're going to pull here this point a little bit, and you're going to unfold the model just just a small bit here let me zoom in to make it easier to understand so as you can see I just pulled here these two layers a little bit and you're going to fold here making a curve okay from this line to this line here now just make here some curves use your use your finger like this okay press here three fingers like this and this and keep doing this and that's it the wing is going to look like this do the same thing to this side so pull here, make a curve from one line to another line, okay, and pull here, making, adding some curves, okay, so the wings are going to look like this, now in this part here is going to be something like this, first you have to fold here the whole model in half, Okay, and fold along this line and this line here. Okay. okay. Now you're going to fold here this layer. Okay. Like this. And the same thing here, fold making this layer look like this, okay? And you're going to pull here this part a little bit, fold upward and close here the middle thing. I mean, make the valley fold here, here, and a mountain fold in the middle. Okay, the problem with this fold is that it's not going to be here. Let me show you again. As you can see here, the middle fold is going to be a little bit loose, like this. So just careful here now this bottom part here is going to be interesting to fold it's going to be like this you have okay pull here just one line you have this first layer here right you're going to make a curve here making this fold here look like this make a curve to inside this well it's not very well drawn but it's like this okay so you have this curve here right now you're going to do the same thing here so make a curve this make this fold like this, just hold here these two layers strongly and roll here a little bit in the middle okay and in this last layer you're going to do the same thing here so roll a little bit okay 
And as you can see, you have these three curves here. You just have to finish curving. Make here a curve. Oh, this one didn't didn't get really nice because I made it a little bit fast, a little bit too fast, and it wasn't really precise. But well, try to fold here carefully. The idea is, is really really simple. You just have to make a curve here in all layers to make the whole origami look like this, and do the same thing here. And after you do on this on both sides you're just going to hold here the middle like this and open it a little bit be careful oh, this paper here is not good but well be careful when you do this okay and the model is going to look like this. I hope you could understand. I know it's it's a little bit hard to understand the to understand some details of this organ here. But well basically that's it. Thanks for watching this video. See you, bye bye.